the man I live with, my roommate, uh, he calls himself Raj B. Raj B. R O G B R O G B, and um, on YouTube he got uh, his comments uh, suspended, his commenting abilities suspended on YouTube, and they did not tell him why. And uh, if they're assuming that he knows why, um, he doesn't know why because the guidelines on YouTube and on many platforms are so vague and so detailed and so like two or three or four or five pages long. It's hard for us to read those guidelines. And even if we did know all the guidelines, per se, we'd be having some trouble uh, understanding them. You know, they, the guidelines usually say stuff like, don't say anything offensive, don't say anything hate speech or, or whatever. But um, now, um, real quick, oh, a minute has already gone by. Uh, what did they accuse you of, Bruce? What did they accuse you of saying? Something mm -hmm. like something like um you had to say something about biden yeah, got I, walked back on something president uh, got well, walked I, back I, I, that's what i said but they didn't really give me anything um, um specific uh -huh. they said uh, something like it's come to our attention that you you may you have may have violated, violated you know some vague you know thing violated uh, on guidelines yeah something like that oh. Um, so I, I asked, uh, uh, I guess a total of three times, you know, give me something specific. Don't tell me what I'm doing wrong or what you think I'm doing no wrong. No response. No response. It's like no due process. Right, no due process. No constitutional exactly. due process. That's like being accused of a crime you didn't know what you did. Yeah, it's, it's like a little minor uh, ju justice system uh, without due process. You have a right to know what you're charged with. Yeah. Okay, I gotta go now, and I'm um, gonna be putting this up on YouTube and Clapper. <laughs> Shame on our systems.